Hello YouTube, I'm just showing off um, how my stack's been coming along. Um, some of this stuff you might have seen before if you've seen my uh, previous videos, but a lot of it is new. So, let me just go over this. Uh, just bought this today. It's a Barber Quarter, $18.99. And uh, Standing Liberty, $19.29 I think. And a 2000 Massachusetts quarter. I, I don't think that's silver. But um, here's the backs to it. The barber, real tarnished. And the standard Liberty back. Uh, here is uh, the only silver round I, I'm planning on getting. I made a mistake. I, I jumped the gun on this one too quick. I, I usually do not like to get rounds. Uh, bars are a different story. I, I would like to get a bar. But, uh, yeah, this is it. This is uh, the dawn of a new millennium. And it's got a kind of purplish toning on the back of it. I guess it's tarnishing. But I, I jumped the gun on this one. I, I, I saw 2000. And I was thinking, cool, it's the, um, because I have the colorized version, this one's actually legit United States, but I, I jumped the gun on this one, I didn't look at the back and saw that it was a round, and I missed a 92 and 94 American Eagle that I could have bought, but, um, hey, it's silver, it's an ounce, and, um, a little thing, a uh, certificate. Uh, yeah, and here I got uh, two 2014s right here, right? Yep, 2014, 2014, and I have a 2010 here. Yeah, the iPhone camera sucks. You just have to take my word for it. Uh, 2012 American Eagle. And uh, 1986 key date in the series. I guess it's the only one. But, um, yeah, uh, I was happy to get this one. And of course, you uh, 2000 colorized. And here I have the. Uh, 90% Lewis and Clark 2004 uh, what is it bicentennial yeah the bicentennial dollar I, I, th I like that one that was a nice find might have paid a little too much for it but whatever and uh, this is a United States a San Francisco mint proof set um, I'm not sure if these are silver the reason why I got these is because the the 80 and the 81 Susan B. Anthony's are, are hard to find. To me, they are. And I have not seen them unless they were in proof sets. So this is the 81, the 80 I just showed you. And here is a 2014 $5 gold piece. I plan on getting these. Nine more I'll have an ounce. Get my goal for the year. Plan on stepping up my uh, my silver purchases so I can hit my goal. And right now I'm way behind. I only got like what seven ounces of actual silver. I don't really count the um, 90 percent. I, I want actual silver, but if I have to, I I'll count the um, 90 percent. Yeah, you, I guess you already saw this. To, uh, three cent silver the 1962 proof 1899 barber cord no barber half 1912 barber quarter 1921 peace dollar 1962 Benjamin Franklin the uh, 1922 peace dollar I'm sorry this was a Morgan dollar 1921 Morgan dollar here I have a uh, 1941 mercury dime and here is a 
1953 Cuban Quarter, some kind of centennial they have. I forget the dude's name. Uh, it's in my previous video where I mentioned it. A 1915 uh, Mercury Dime. This is a, a newer purchase, I believe. And here I have an 1884 Morgan Dollar. And then I have an 1844 uh, Seated Liberty Quarter. And here I have a 19, 1961 D Brilliant Uncirculated Roosevelt Dime. And I have an 1858 what the heck, uh, Seated Liberty Half Dime. And a 1916 Barber Dime. There are the backs of them. I think this is the half time, right? No, this is the half time, right? Now, so I don't know if you can read it. Uh, I had an iPhone camera, it really does stink. And, uh, yeah. Well, I um, hope you enjoyed my videos. I'll be keeping you guys updated. And um, well, keep watching and goodbye.